so my hair is in desperate need of a wash right now like it's long overdue it needs a wash and um i don't know why i have not washed my hair yet this is hair day five and it has gotten to that point where you just don't know what else to do with your hair so let's get into the video let's get started with this it has gel in it and all those type of crap but that's not the point of this video i just wanted to show you guys how i style my horrible dirty hair that just needs a wash and how i style it and make it look as if my hair had just gotten a shampooed had just gotten shampooed and it looks all nice and fresh ends are all matted i'm not even gonna batter with the ends pulling the ends doing anything to the ends i'm not gonna even batter with this um yeah because i know i won't be able to budge a comb in this <laughs> no so we're just gonna do the only thing that we can I'll go ahead and spritz some water and just kind of get it not even damp just kind of to loosen up the products that are already in there um the thing is my hair absolutely absolutely hit water Whenever I add a lot of water in it, it just shrinks and I can't do anything with it. So my hair hits water. Next, I'm gonna take a little bit of my Eco Styler Gel. You can never put in too much Eco Styler Gel. You can never. I'm telling you. So I'm just gonna slap this all over my frontal hair and I'm just gonna mainly focus on my roots instead of the ends because again no one cares about the ends right now so they're just gonna be tucked away and under so once i have enough again i'm gonna go in with some water in the palm of my hands i'm gonna apply some more And I'm just going to kind of mold the style and just kind of smooth it out with my, with the palm of my hands. Put in with my bristle brush and I'm just going to brush up. And I have such a big forehead, you guys. <laughs> my forehead is so big, like, come on. And I hate the fact that I have this M shape right there like i'm so self-conscious of this it's annoying so i'm applying more gel just because i want this to be laid and again the hair is gonna get washed soon so i can just bathe my hair in gel it really doesn't matter because it's gonna get washed pretty soon so yeah so is anyone else like me i can never use hair tie to tie my own hair like I can never never use a hair tie to tie my hair because it will never be as tight as I want it to be so I always end up using uh, some type of thread or you know some type of something but a hair tie I can never you guys this is a definite must a bristle brush when a bristle a, a bristle brush my hair tie like hair extension i always tie my hair with hair extension that's the only way i can get it tight i cannot use a hair tie it will never be tight never right now it looks like i have a peanut head but that's okay um i'm just gonna brush it some more and tuck it in like that and keep it in place with a rubber band like this with the got to be glued um, styling gel I'm gonna go in with just a small like just the smallest smallest amount and I'm just gonna kind of rub it in and I'm just gonna lightly apply it over the hair and that's just gonna help with any flyaway and it's just gonna keep this hair in place until like the next day honestly 
So, yeah. So next, I'm going to go in with this clip-on puff. Um, I'm going to leave the link down below as to where you can find it. Like, um, so if this was the first day I would naturally wear my natural puff, but since my ends are right now so knotted and I can't help them, so that's when I pull out my, my clip-on puff. And I'm going to leave down a link below as to where you can find it. And this is such a lifesaver. Like, yes. <laughs> so, like, it does have two combs on each side. I'm going to go ahead and just kind of use both of the clips, right? And I'm going to clip, um, clip it like this. One of them in the back and the other one in the front like that. Close to my ponytail. And then I'm going to use the string. And I'm just going to pull it tight, super duper tight, because I love my ponytail to be slick and stay put. So now I'm going to use the string, the extra string. I'm just going to go ahead and wrap it around. And then for the end, I'm just going to use a bobby pin just to secure it in place so it won't move. So this is it right now. It looks super natural. looks super good. It won't move. It won't go anywhere. But just to be more careful, <laughs> I'm going to go in with some more bobby pin and I'm just going to secure it. And again, I like to use some of my water. I'm just going to spray it around the hair and I'm just gonna kind of fluff it out so it can look a little bit more natural I'm just gonna fluff it out with my finger I was such in a bad mood it's crazy like I was not feeling myself I just felt weird like super weird are any of you guys out there just like that like just wake up just a regular day you just woke up out of bed and you're just not feeling yourself that was me yesterday i felt so annoyed like i don't know what was going on so i'm gonna go in with some more gel i'm gonna use my edge my edge brush there's so many different ways to style your edges like where did this pimple come from like why like why are you here it's so annoying super annoying anyways like I was saying I, I woke up yesterday feeling out of it I was super annoyed like I didn't feel like myself it was just a weird day like, it just felt like I was on my period but when I'm on my period I'm never moody I'm not I'm not like that so it's just weird like I kind of understand why some girls will say like when I'm on my period I just don't feel like myself and stuff like now I kind of understand how that felt because yesterday I was just in such a bad mood like I literally had to force myself to come out of the house because I'm like I just couldn't do it like I didn't want to stay home I just like I had to get out and just feel free you know so weird let me know down below what do you guys do to just feel more like yourself on a day like that. What I what I did was um go out and I went I go out and just listen to some music in the car and and slowly by listening just by listening to music I slowly kind of felt like myself again. Um but yeah, just let me know down in the comment section below what do you guys do when you're feeling like this on a regular day, you know? Like, what do you do to just feel like yourself again? Any tips? Because that was super weird. I, I just didn't feel right. Okay, guys. So, this is where the crucial part comes in. Don't ever, like, tie it too tight. So it won't leave like any lines, like demarcation lines on your forehead. And um, yeah, so I just kind of tie it down just so that it can stay laid. And um, 
yeah so and again if you have your makeup like it wouldn't leave that demarcation line on your forehead okay, so now I'm just gonna go ahead and do my makeup just because I'm not going anywhere it's almost midnight I don't know why but I just had the urge to kind of just make up the face so you can all tie in together <laughs> so that's what I'm gonna do now I'm so weird you guys I just I was bored and I needed to do something and that was it you guys do a video for you guys like why not Alright guys, so adding these little gold, um, so I went ahead and add these gold cuffs to my hair. They're completely um, optional. It's just I like my hair to be just a little bit more extra, I guess. So um, yeah, I do that. And another thing is if you have like crochet curly hair like I do right now, um, it's just to add more cutesy to it um, this is all optional that's if you want to do it so I just kind of take the strand of hair and I place a bobby pin right um, I fold it and place a bobby pin right in the middle right there and I go ahead and just kind of clip it to kind of like the side the front side of the hair like all the way up there I pin it up here <clears throat> <clears throat> and it just kind of looks so nice like it's my natural hair that I kind of pull out it just kind of add like this natural vibe to it so my hair just won't look all you know so it just kind of add a little cute look to it um, you can always leave one strand and it's also optional to add another strand so it's up to you whatever is your taste whatever. this is it um I'm gonna add a little bit of a bron bronzer to my forehead because I feel like it's getting a lot of attention. So I'm just gonna kind of add some bronzer right there because we don't need all this attention on you, honey. Alright, we kind of tone it down. <laughs> Cause I feel like it was getting all the attention like no no don't do that so you guys get yourself a silk scarf it's definitely gonna be worth your money get yourself a silk scarf it is super duper helpful um, it helps keep your hair slick and nice so yeah it's it plays a big part in keeping my hair slick it looks like I should be going out somewhere like <laughs> to be honest with you I'm going nowhere it's almost midnight and right now I just wish I had somewhere to go anyways I'm gonna show you guys the back look I'm going nowhere actually I am going somewhere I'm going to bed <laughs> and look this shit looks so so good it looks so good if you're new to my channel you are not subscribed come let me tell you a little secret you better subscribe right now you better subscribe and come on and join the beauty gang like what are you waiting for you're missing out honey go ahead and subscribe and it's so weird right if someone will come down the stairs right now they'll think I'm speaking to myself but no I'm speaking to you I keep calling this a smoothie. It's not a smoothie. It's my protein shake. 